taking the stage dressed in what they aspire to be, these young children have convinced the audience they have what it takes to be a mini professional, whether it is in the airline industry. I want to be a pilot. Yeah. Paramedic. or earning a living as a subsistence farmer. Successful farmer, you need to know traditional farming methods. These children have set their minds on career goals at an early age. Executive Officer for Bukbilong Pikinini, Lian Resson, has described the formulation of the When I Grow Up series as exciting and rewarding. First, um, emo I'm emotional, you know, because um, a lot of what you do, you know, we're so involved in the programs and all that and um, we don't realize how much impact uh, that we have, you know, in this children. So when we see, you know, like an event like this um, and the um, support from all our partners, you know, that's as emotional. I'm proud and I'm happy. Like I mentioned earlier, it's a very rewarding experience. We wouldn't have been able to do all this or come this far without um, the support from our partners. The launching of these books, which falls on the last day of the National Literacy Week, is a step towards building a mini library for mini professionals. A video that beautifully captures the mini professionals in their roles was also launched today. A second series is in production stage and captures another set of mini professionals. Um, and we thought it would be important um, that children see themselves in the books that we have in the library. So this is how the series came about. Um, we also thought that it's important for children to learn from an early age, start to see um, their future careers, future professions, what they want to be when they grow up. So when they come in and learn, you know, they are motivated and encouraged. Um, when, we, when we have, um, you know, when we have them study about what they want to be when they grow up. So we've worked with our partners. Um, big thanks to our partners as well. With the need to improve literacy rates in the country, the circulation, the curriculum used in developing the series, there was close consultation with the Department of Education and Book Belong Pikinini. I congratulate Book Belong Pikinini for this achievement and hope the secretary himself will come at that time to do the launching. The Department of Education, of Education together with the parents is concerned about the data regarding the improvement of li literacy and numeracy in Papua New Guinea. We see Book Belong Pikinini taking charge to improve literacy and numeracy with evidence of improvement through their learning centers where children are able to read and able to read simple sentences, write, do basic maths, and have a good level of general knowledge. These books will be sold at TO Disc and at Book Belong Pikinini. Tekla Gunga, National MTV News.